from uh, playing it at E3 last year. And uh, I hope uh, you will join me on my adventure. And you can check this out. I had uh, uh, some really good time with uh, Horizon Zero Dawn on the PlayStation 4. And some really good time at, with uh, um, Zelda on the Switch. But it's time to play an Xbox exclusive. Let's see if I can find the chat window, though. Okay, one second here. Okay. There we go, we are live. All right, um, let's switch to uh, Xbox on Snap. Xbox on Snap. There we go. All right, so we got. Uh, Let's see the video window in. Oh, there we go. I have the chat open. Hello. Uh, VR God 1975, how's it going? All right, come along on this journey with me. Let's give this a shot. So we're going to start with the uh, the campaign. Let's do this. New game. Bam. Let's play normal. Sure, let's play the tutorial. So this is uh, starting point one. Drinking some tea, playing some Halo Wars 2. Can you hear me okay? Give me a thumbs up if you can hear me okay. VR God. Okay, I think I'm on. I think it's happening. Okay. Have you got any of you mad soldiers? Stop fidgeting. There we go. Sounds good. Awesome. Thank you. Uh, hey, Vic. Nice to have you back from your travels. Yeah, it, uh, it's been pretty crazy. A couple trips to San Francisco and one to Toronto, and uh, we're just into March, and all of these games are hitting at exactly the same time. Good. Okay, so what am I going to do? Okay. All right. So I can look around with my left thumbstick. And uh, I was worried it was gonna be a quiet. I can zoom the camera in and out like that with the right thumbstick. Now select your squad marines. Okay, so we're gonna select these guys. Marines ready to serve. Clear your currently selected units by pressing B. So for those just joining, I am uh, playing through the tutorial. This is my first real kick at Halo Wars 2. I feel like I've been uh, uh, in uh, PlayStation 4 exclusive land and uh, Switch exclusive land, and it was time to be on the Xbox One exclusive land for a little bit here. Okay, move the reticle over your Marines and press the A to select them again. Units must be selected before you can issue the orders. Let's issue a move order now. I'm, uh, I'm using the Xbox One S... Um, white controller that came with the Xbox One S. I love this thing. I love this console. I love the way games look and run on it. It's awesome. 
And I like this controller. I do like the uh, the Elite controller. I use that for PC games mostly. <clears throat> Let me know if the game's too loud or if any, anything I can change to make anything better. Uh, okay, move your reticle over the waypoint marker and press X on your unit. Uh, uh, press X to order your unit to move there. There we go. Oh, I bet the Elite controller is awesome for this, though, right? You can just tap buttons and, uh, and uh, basically hotkey everything. Oh, thanks, Warconus. Yeah, that game was nuts. Um, you know, they're coming out so fast and furious that I hated putting that one down and moving on to the next one, but uh, I've got to keep playing new things, right? We've got our orders. Let's go! Wonderful game, though. Holy crap, we're being spoiled right now. This is one of the strongest starts in video game history. And Japan has been on a tear. Holy crap, Japan has just been making amazing games over the last six months. Blown my mind. Okay, press RB to select all units in view. Okay. Hey, I'm just going to tweet out that I'm uh, I'm live. I haven't been on Twitch in a while, so I didn't know if everything was going to work. Everything seems to be working. I'm going to I'm going to tweet out that I'm there. Give me one second here. All right, one sec. Live tweeting while I'm on uh, Twitch. Is that uh, party foul? Uh, come join me and check out uh, Halo Wars 2. Time for uh, an Xbox One exclusive. Twitch.tv slash EPN. Okay, there we go. Come join me and check out Halo Wars 2. Time for an Xbox One exclusive. All right. Okay. So welcome, everybody. Happy Monday. I don't know if it's morning where you are or afternoon. I don't know if you're playing hooky from something, but I appreciate you being here. Thank you. Uh, clear your uh, currently selected units by pressing B. All right, little dudes. What are we going to do? Uh, okay, so hold A and move the... Okay. We're up. Now move all the units under your command to the next location. All right. Let's see. Come on up here. Let's move it. On maneuvers. There are enemy Marines nearby. Order your squad to attack them. All right. Let's get some fighting going on. Come on, Marines. We won't even break a sweat. Yeehaw! Get him. Good work, Commander. All right. Your units have taken some damage during combat, but you have earned a leader point. I earned a meter point. point to unlock a leader power. Let's choose a power that will heal your units. Oh, a leader point. Okay. Uh, leader. Okay. Now select the restoration drone's leader power. Nice. Excellent. You've unlocked restoration drones. Now let's use them to heal your units. Now you've ready your leader power. Use it to heal your units. Cool. Leader powers can make the difference between victory and defeat. So use them wisely. Still weird to play an RTS on a console. It's so crazy. More enemies are coming. Okay. Move your Marines into cover in that garrison. All right, let's, let's get this. Creative uh, Assembly and 343 is a bit of a uh, like a rock and roll super group, though. I've been uh, dying to get into this one. Zips around pretty quickly. Good. Nice. Have been 
Delta. Order your units out of the garrison. Okay. Let's go. Okay. Next, you'll need to build more units to grow your army. Move all your units to the marked base plot. Come on back here, guys. We're moving out, squad. There we go. You'll need resources to build your first fire base. Let's go collect those resources now. When building structures and units, you'll use two types of resources. Power and supply. Always keep an eye out for resources on the battle. Marconius, I'm supposed to go over to Relic pretty soon. I came back with the uh, the GM of the studio on the on the plane from GDC. They're based here in Vancouver. And uh, they know I'm a fan of that franchise, so I, I, I'm probably going to get in and, uh, and do a video and get some good hands-on time pretty soon. comes out April. They just announced the release date, April 24th, I think. Good. Notice that your supply increased after the gathering of supply caches. All right. Okay. Do I want them all? Yeah, okay, we want them all. Okay, let's build some stuff. Okay, let's go. Hustle, 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 hustle. Move it, soldiers! I won't do the drill sergeant voice for the entirety of this game. Move out! I give you anyone a Let's go! Make it snappy. Let's do this, troops! Make it snappy! You've got enough resources to build that base. Select the base plot and call it in. All right. So now call, call that in. Base from the spirit of fire. Nice. Good. I wish the you could snap up and I watch it. So it's a good time to collect more supplies. Drop from the sky? Time. Yeah, I think it's going to drop, right? Is that what's happening? Okay. All right, guys. I need you dudes you over here. Let's go. All right. Yeah, I played through the, um, they had a hands-on a few months ago. We did some videos on it, uh, but I played through it twice because I, and I didn't want to leave. I was like, that, that, that's all we get. I want, I want to keep going. It was very fun and very, very pretty. Okay. Cool. 15 seconds. And then I'll have some more buddies join my party. Halo party. Ain't no party like a halo party. Okay. Fire base is now ready. You'll need a supply pad to boost your supply income. Let's Call one in on the empty build socket. Okay. Supply pad. Any of you guys pick up the switch on the weekend? Excellent. Uh, of supplies from the supply pad. Oh great. Okay. Now recruit a squad. Hey, a Rouge. Firebase's central structure. Okay, select the base and open up its radial menu. Okay. I don't have enough supplies, they're coming in. Oh, I need my uh, dudes to go get them. Look alive, Marines! Go get them, guys. Get out. these things. Oops. Stand to, troops! Sound off, Marines! We're moving out, squad! Move out with me! All you need is on the ground. <laughs> so cool, man. Look at that. Great little details. I like it. Okay. Marines are a good all-purpose infantry unit and can always be recruited from any base or mini base. Note that they only require supply resources to produce. Your other resource is power. Build a generator so you can produce power. Okay. Pretty 
pretty streamlined so far. Come a long way since uh, StarCraft II on the Super Nintendo. Now you have a steady income of the two resources, power and supply. Thank you, A. Rouge. You're the best. Next, build the barracks so you can recruit advanced infantry units. Switch is still out of stock at local retail. Yeah, I think Nintendo KG. KG. It's going to be tricky to get one of those suckers, I think, for the next couple of months. Okay, guys. Now build us a lot of help orders from the barracks. Like all advanced units, they require both supplies and power to build. So we want some Hellbringers, and where do we want them? Over here. Okay. Sweet. Anti-infantry units. I can see why... Bob Cobb, I could see why you were asking about the uh, Elite Controller, yeah. All the extra buttons, you'd probably want them. This looks like it's going to get pretty micromanagey very soon. Okay, let's go get these guys. What are you doing? Nice. Look at these guys, burn them up. Oh, they're dead. Well, let's make some more. Got him, guys. What are you doing? Sir, Slow down. Alright. You've completed basic training. You can now complete the advanced training or head straight down to the war. Good luck out there, Commander. I think I'm going to do the advanced training because it's going to teach me things I know I will need. So bear with me, everybody. I'm learning the game. I hope your Monday is going well. It snowed here in Vancouver yesterday. We don't know what the hell is going on. It's uh, never like this here, but uh, sure look Christmassy. Uh, mission pack, okay, they give you the cards, of course. They want you to get into the collectibles and the purchasables of the game. Okay, uh, so what now? Um. Advanced tutorial, gotcha. Okay, here we go. What's everybody and what's everybody been blah, 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 what's everybody been playing recently? Welcome to the advanced tutorial training, Commander. Advanced training will give you the upper hand on the battlefield. First, we're going to cover how to increase your base's tech level. A lot to choose from these days. Our tech levels unlock new building slots and production of more advanced units and unit upgrades. Upgrade your fire base to a combat station now. All right, let's do that. Okay, select my base. Combat station. Okay. Horizon. Yeah, killer game, man. Incredible. Your Marines have now been upgraded with a special ability to throw grenades. Use your Marines' grenades to quickly clear out those enemies. Sweet. Grenades. Um. <laughs> That's great. Thank you. Battlefield 1. God, it feels like that came out like five years ago, Battlefield 1. There's been so many games since then. 
And it's so it's awesome. But I haven't gone back to it in, in now, months. Let's move on to advanced unit selection techniques. Here come some reinforcements now. Now, select all your units from across the battlefield. Okay, how do I select? Oh. Stand to, troops. Marines ready to serve. Can't really see everything. Can't go far enough back. We're up, Leathernecks. All right. Sound off, Marines. Oh yeah, I got a bunch. Okay, where are we going? Oh, double tap. Selecting all your units Great. can be useful for quickly moving all your units at once. Okay. Move all your units to the next waypoint marker. Where is where that? There it is. Move. Move it. Move it, soldiers. How's Battlefield 1 uh, holding up over the months? Is it still super fun? Super filled with uh, combatants and people to take down? I'd probably get slaughtered if I poke my head up in that game. Okay, use RT to cycle through your selected unit types. Okay. Cycling is a good way to quickly select individual types of units from a larger group. Now let's review other ways to quickly select units of the same type. Okay. Each unit type has its own strengths and weaknesses. Knowing how to use those strengths and exploit those weaknesses is the key to victory. Double tap in that, uh, arm, that right bumper is pretty handy. Oh, that's cool. Cool. If you have multiple bases, multiple presses to the left on your D-pad will cycle through all your bases. Sweet. Next, press down on the D-pad to jump to your units. How the hell could you start the campaign without knowing this stuff? down jump between clusters of units. Okay. Now hold up on the D-pad to set a rally point. Sweet. This is where new units move to when they are built from your bases. You have a battlefield alert. Press right on the D-pad to jump to the alert and take out the enemy. Oh, that's great. Control nice. groups are another way of managing large numbers of troops. And effective unit control is essential to winning battles. Okay. Now let's assign some units to a control group using what you already learned. Select all local units. Now assign those units to a control group. Next, hold down any direction on the D-pad to assign and slow, okay? Excellent. Now yeah. you can use the D-pad to quickly select those units assigned to that control group. That's Let's great. Let's try that now. Now yeah. use the D-pad to select the units assigned to that control Good. Sweet. You can have one control group assigned to each of the directions on the D-pad. Now move all your units to the next waypoint marker. Move out with me! And they had to really just rethink the controls in this game to make it all make sense. There are enemies above you on the high ground. It's so hard to play a console game like this and not just want to zip down and take control of one of these little dudes. Okay, so what are we doing? Get try to get the high ground, okay. I ain't giving anyone a piggyback. Let's go! That. Oh, okay. You're under attack from the enemies above. Move your units up there to take them out. Okay. Oh, nice. Burn them. Burn them. on higher ground have extended sight and firing ranges. Engaging an enemy from higher ground can let you shoot them before they can shoot you back. Put them out of their misery! Grenades! Use them all! Now keep moving to the next Please. objective marker. Okay. Group 2. Let's go! Move 
You've reached the bridge. Move a unit to the control panel to activate the bridge. Okay. Let's get going! Oh, let's mosey. Make it a move. Move out, Marines! Moving. On the double. I'll hold it on the control panel. Okay. Gotcha. Marines reported for duty. I think my tank is leaking. Get yourself in order, Marines! Anyone here a doctor? I didn't want to use it. Let's see this. Okay. Got it. Okay. Stand to, troops. Group two. Cross the bridge to reach the next objective marker. Nice. Let's get going! Oh, move out. Shake your tail. So I feel like I'm learning all this stuff and then I'm gonna get into battle and they're just gonna make me just like glass all over the all over the the planet's surface. Careful, Commander. We've detected enemy air units nearby. All right. Every time the unit has a counter. Marines are an effective counter to air units, so I'm sending in marine reinforcements now. Use your marines to destroy those air units, Commander. Okay. Super cool. Nice. Good work, Commander, but we're not done yet. Group two. The enemy is planning a counterattack with Scorpion tanks, which will oh. easily destroy your Marines. Vehicles are vulnerable to air units, so I'm sending you some Hornets to counter the enemy tanks. I'm getting hit for artillery up here. My guys just booted it out of there. They're gone. <laughs> and the Hornet claims another kill. Excellent. But now the enemy is sending in Marines to counter your air units. Okay. Your air units won't last long against their Marines. So friendly Scorpion tanks are inbound to help deal with them. Awesome. All units delivered to DZ. Over. Ready to bring the hurt. Get him. Bad idea. Not a problem. Let's make this a crap on level. Get these guys. Come on. What are you doing? Scorpion and Rue. Are they stuck? We've got a backup plan. Where do you need me? They're stuck. Don't blame me if this goes belly up. I think I... This is crashed. Making tracks. They're not moving. Uh oh. Tanks. You better move. This crate is barely up to it. Oh man. That sucks. I don't have any other units. They've all just disappeared, so this is crashed right there. Look at this. Unreal. On the move. Welcome to the war zone, kid. Need something slagged? Come on. Come move. on move. That sucks. Um, resign. All right, I think I got it. Anyways, let's start into the uh, campaign and see how that goes. Not a great sign if the uh, the game crashes in the tutorial, though. Okay. Uh, boom. Normal. Let's do this. I'm going to eat a spoonful of cereal one second. Oh, maybe two. Captain, wake up. 
something has happened. The spirit of Lara is in a situation I could not anticipate. I'm certain Professor Anders would enjoy that planned mission. So let's keep it between us, shall we? We've been adrift for just over 28 years. I've made quite a few repairs while you were sleeping. So ship systems are 100%. Cryo-overwhelm, and med stats are not a living group on green. As for me, well, regulations are clear about our final dispensation at the end of an AI's seven-year lifespan. I took care of my own arrangements rather than wake you. I didn't want to. Well, I hope you can forgive this final breach of protocol. It was a pleasure and an honor to serve with you, sir. Do look after her, would you? Goodbye, Captain. Serena out. I need to get down there. Immediately, of course. Good morning to you, too, Professor. I'm sorry, Captain. It's good to see you, too. But just look at it. Wow. What is it? And where are we? Uh, no idea. Our astro navigation system can't pinpoint a location. We're not on the map anymore. We didn't drift out of the galaxy in 21 years, Professor. Since records show we arrived via slip space less than an hour ago? Our slip space drive is gone. However we got here, it wasn't us who initiated the trip. Something down there... Must have opened the portal from this end and pulled us in. Let's hear what they have to say. Security measures have advanced without us. But it is coming through on a UNSC frequency. This is good. And we left the wasn't coming on. The signal means the UNSC is still fighting. Maybe, Maybe we even won. won. What's the source of the transmission? We don't have the surface details yet, sir. Something down there is blocking our scans, and without Serena. But we do have a rough location. Should be simple enough to triangulate once we pick up the signal from the ground. Cutter to Jerome. Prep smart red team and small recon squad. Professor Anders will send you the coordinates. Find out who's sending that signal. Be on the ground within the hour. Travel low. Right yeah. 28 Wait, years, here. Professor. Let's see what kind of galaxy we woke up to. <laughs> there is an echo. I don't know. I can't tell if that's from... Any update on the source of that signal? It wasn't easy, but I've narrowed it down to a small sector and our recon teams are investigating now. I've cleared up the scans a bit and it looks like there's a UNSC outpost or research station, but it's heavily damaged. It doesn't look good, but the Spartans will handle it. They always do. It would be a lot faster if you let me go down with them. Yeah, I'm hearing the echo here coming through my speakers, so I guess that's the way. Besides, we don't know what's waiting for us down there. Jerome. I guess that's the way they recorded it. Or they put it together on the game. Stand by 
Wow. Feels good to have our feet back on real ground again, doesn't it, Alice? You saw this place in the drop down, Douglas. Nothing real about it. This is a weird echo. I don't know why it's echoing like that. Keep your eyes out for trouble. Spartan Jerome here. The drill sergeant wasn't echoing in the tutorial. On the way. On my way. I'm there. Less, less echo now. Set up to clear a path for you when you're ready. I don't know what they were defending against. There's some heavy duty barricades here. No, there's echo. Everybody get clear. Light up those charges, Alice. Taking them down. Alright. They won't use that again. <laughs> Jerome, these aren't are military defenses. No, these were made in a hurry. They must have been desperate. Why would they have defenses? They must have expected to get targeted from the cover. Sweet. Moving to position. This looks really good. It's on a. I'm playing it on a 4K TV and it looks sweet. I don't think there's HDR or I'm not. I didn't see the HDR thing pop up, but. I'm there. It's got a lot of detail. It, I mean, it's it's so detailed. You want to just jump into the cars and stuff. I guess that's the uh, that's the challenge of uh, you know modern RTS games. Look at that! It just I should just be able to jump right into that warthog right there. Okay. I sound clear. Okay, great. So it must be in the game, the echoey thing. I have the mu I have the music off too, so maybe the music kind of masks a lot of that when you're playing the game. That's our way across. Let's get that Oh, it's so dope. I do wish I could just zoom right out. You guys remember Total Annihilation and how far you could zoom out on that game? So ahead of its time. What's a nightingale doing here? Do we have wounded? Moving out. Whipping around. It's pretty pretty flashy. On my way. Moving to position. Spartan, moving out. Getting to one of our recon team, sir. We found them like this when we arrived. Didn't see what hit him. Looks like we may see some action after all. Let's show them what we can do. On the way. Spark so, moving out. So cool. That's it's like our recon team scouted out this portal. Playing a toy version of signal. of Halo, I've like a Halo the mission. Forces to stay back and protect your exit while you investigate. Yes, sir. Sounds like I'm talking to myself. Well, I kind of am. So everything's echoing off of the console. Hmm. I don't know what to do. Does it sound terrible? Okay, I don't know what happened. I just disappeared. Where am I? I just ended up in the, uh, where am I? Where did I go? I'm up here, okay. <laughs> How was I supposed to do that? Ready for duty. Okay, I'm supposed to go over here. Right? Yeah, I'm supposed to go down here. Come on here, guys. Zero nine two, ready to go. go. I've heard it sound okay, good a few times. Crap! Should I should I stop and start the stream again? What do you guys think? Odd. They look like they've been modified, and those machines attached to them aren't UNSC tech. Keep an eye out for any more of them. Spartan, moving out. You, 
guys tell me. I can keep on going or I can uh, stop and start. See if it, I can fix it. On my way. Outpost. Spirit of fire, we're outside. Base looks clear from out here. Let's see who's been calling. I think this just started the echoey thing. I don't think it was echoing uh, during the tutorial. Yep, it's me. Black Helmet Man. CB Anthony, you rock, man. Thank you. I think it just started too, so I don't know what's. Maybe it's just some kind of hitch on this load or something. This is insane. It's so beautiful. how they gotta make the Halo movie, man. Like, give it to a CG house like this one. It's so good. Hang on. Oh man, this is cool. Fun. <laughs> right on, I'm jumping off a cliff. You're lucky to be alive. This is not a typical RTS. Holy crap. It's a trap. Whoa! 
Yeah, Black Helmet Man, I am just getting started. This is first mission. Just started the campaign. Been swamped with stuff, so. But uh, I've been dying to get to this. if it uh, corrects itself when it loads new stuff. She'll stay silent up there until she has a good shot at getting back to us. Sir? Isabel, this is Captain Cutter. I know who you are. James Cutter. Captain of the Spirit of Fire. We're supposed to be lost with all hands. Not so lost, it seems. What happened down there? I need to know what we're up against. Isabel? Isabel, report. Sir, five months ago, the portal from the Ark to Earth shut down without warning. A month later, he arrived. He? Oh, this echo is bugging me. The brute. Their leader. His name is Atriox. Cool. During the war, the Covenant used his cleverness, expendable muscle. Told them dying in battle. Black Helmet, man, that game is hard to peel myself away from, I'll tell you that, man. Amazing. Same with Horizon. to break the front lines. to die for beliefs not their own. None ever returned. Until he did. This all looks sensational. So battle by battle. War by war. 39 brothers at a time. Atriox was born. With every victory, his legend and his hatred of the Covenant grew. Eventually, both were impossible to conceal. And they tried to banish him. And everything we know about the Covenant's thousand-year history. Atriox was the first to defy the Covenant and survive. And his defiance inspired others. I'm gonna restart. Atriox and his banished raided Covenant resources, cutting a swath across the galaxy. Growing in strength. Get to the end of this cutscene, I'll do that. Gathering killers and mercenaries to his side. The Covenant had two targets in those years. Humanity and Atriox. They almost got us. But Atriox, they never came close. One old ship and half a crew to staff her? We need to run as far and as fast as we can. We are just one ship. And an old one at that. But here we are. 
30 years past what anyone could ask of us. Our war is gone. The lives we had are gone. The worlds we knew have moved on. And now, all that we may have left they really get you in the mood, these cutscenes, man. Like, they really want, they, they pull you right in. It's fantastic work. Fighting side by side. Together. Where you see half a crew, Isabel. I see family. Courage. And a thousand heroes who swore to fight their way through hell before the ever turn their backs and run. And where you see one old ship, I see hope. And that is always worth fighting. Great Battlestar Galactica. Oh, I sure have, Dunbones. If we don't stop Atriox now, we leave the galaxy at the mercy of a monster. So no, Isabel. We won't be running anywhere today. Sir, yes, sir. That was dope. Okay, I'm restarting. I'm going to see if I can... Uh... I appreciate a good rousing speech as much as the next day I... But Atriox has had months to say. I'm gonna see if I can uh, figure out this echoey thing. Listen up, team. The banished have dug in deep and dead set on controlling this installation. And we cannot allow that to happen. Strike one. Your job is to establish a forward base. Expect resistance. You heard the captain strike one. Hit them hard, Marines. Okay. Save if I can. Okay, res res okay, I'm gonna resign. Hopefully, it auto saved. And I'm gonna uh, give this a shot again. So, say we all totally tempo. It's getting, getting the battle star, the BSG vibe. God, I missed that show. All right, let's see. Uh, let's see what happens now. Um, I'm just gonna try just jumping right back in and see if. Uh, let's see if we're getting the uh, the echoes. Am I echoing where there's no? Captain, yeah, we're I appreciate the a good rousing speech as much as the next day I. But Atriox has had totally. To okay. I'm gonna I'm gonna kill this stream. I'm gonna start it again, and we'll see what that looks like. That's why we have to fight smart by hitting Atriox's chain of command first. Xbox, Isabel, Snap, Twitch. You know the banished in their operations here. Where do we start? Decimus. He's one of Atriox.